Hey guys, welcome to the Double Chat Show. It's Mike. It's Dan. You know, everyone loves viral videos, especially people in China. Between the QQs, Tudos, uh, Weibo's, and other government allowed social media platforms, news travels fast. There seems to be a viral video of some sort coming out of China each week, and there were plenty that were being watched and shared in 2015. So here are nine videos that went super viral in China, and these are not all fluffy and cute, but they do represent the different genres. Number one, handsome policeman finger dancing video. We mentioned the trend of good looking city workers in our top Chinese trends video, check it out if you haven't. But what made this video interesting is how it came about. 20 year old policeman Yan Yu Li from the Xinjiang region has a special skill. He can dance with his hands. Originally intended to be a finger dancing video set to uptown funk, Officer Yan had no idea that people would be more interested in his boyish good looks than his hand skills. This minutes long video on Weibo, China's version of Twitter, is brilliant. Officer Yan combines his finger movements along with the music and his facial gestures perfectly. And judging by the infatuation Chinese netizens have with good looking bus drivers and policemen, it's no surprise that this made its way onto our viral list. Cause Officer Yan certainly made his way into the hearts of a lot of Chinese women. You like that? That's pretty good actually. I like, I like to combine jazz fingers with everything. Yeah. Okay, are people falling in love with this yet? No. No, because we're not policemen or bus drivers. And we're not incredibly. I don't know. Kind of okay. We're kind of okay looking. Right. Number two, Chinese pollution documentary. We all know China has some of the most polluted, smog filled cities in the world. But what was surprising about this video was that it was actually aired, no pun intended, in China. Chai Jing, a well known Chinese former journalist for none other than CCTV, produced a documentary called Under the Dome, not like the actual show, but you know which examined the grim state of air pollution in China and asked Chinese citizens for help to solve this ongoing problem. This is kind of puzzling since Chinese state medias usually do their best to cover up anything that makes the government look bad. Not only was this documentary shown on Youku, China's version of YouTube, it generated over 100 million views in a short amount of time that triggered a huge emotional response from netizens, including angry comments directed at China's government. This is rare since documentaries like this are usually produced by Western medias like and are usually banned from exposure to eyeballs in China. Hopefully this is a sign for changes to come. Number three, supernatural car crash. Traffic accident videos are always among the most watched videos in China. And at first glance, this video is startling and creepy. It seems like a normal day until all of a sudden a van strangely and violently floats into the air and comes down on its side, hitting the vehicle behind it. A lot of people actually thought this was caused by a unseen ghost because you know, ghosts love haunting castles and flipping over cars until of course it was revealed that the cause of the accident was a sanitation vehicle running over and catching a cable wire underneath the spinning washers. The force of the pole on the wires was so strong that it flipped a van and damaged other cars. Even more amazing was that no one was hurt. I mean, can you imagine the horror if the cable actually uh, touched someone? This video also went super viral in the West where basically every single media outlet picked it up with most people speculating that this was either caused by a ghost or some supernatural phenomenon or even a hoax. Number four, Tianjin Warehouse Blast. I'm sure you're all aware of the horrific warehouse explosion accident in the Chinese city of Tianjin in August of 2015 that left nearly 200 dead and almost 800 injured. However, the most interesting part of this story is how unviral the actual footage and coverage on China state TV was directly following the explosion. Netizen's comments regarding the lack of coverage were with the words Tianjin and explosion were immediately blocked out of social media searches in China. The actual explosion was captured on video by several people and flooded the global media outlets, except in China, of course, where censors were scrambling to keep the discussion within the approved limits. That, of course, didn't stop billions, yes, billions of posts and responses from flooding all Chinese social media outlets. Number five, 50 lane traffic jam. Traffic jams are legendary in China and the biggest ones take place during Golden Week, basically a week long national holiday when everyone goes home. What that translates to is hundreds of millions of people driving on roads at the same time, or as I call it, the car apocalypse. 
The G4 Beijing Hong Kong Macau Expressway was anything but express as a drone video captured the car's sanity and actually showed you where the bottleneck took place. A new checkpoint converted 50 lanes down to 20 and even less as it appears towards the tip. All I'm gonna say is I'll never complain about New York or LA traffic again. But in reality, yeah, I probably will. But this was a picnic compared to the 2010 worst traffic jam in China ever debacle that left people sitting in their cars for, you know what? Guess 12 days. Yeah, 12 days. I mean, where do they do their business and eat and other stuff? Number six, pulsating meat. You all know I love steak, but I have to admit, even this is too gross. A woman in Shandong province this year purchased a chunk of meat. When she got home and opened the package, she found that it was, yeah, still alive. I mean, I've heard of live squid and dancing frog legs and even a whole fish that still moves after you cook it, but pulsating meat? I mean, look at this thing. It's literally twitching. The lady thought there was actually worms or maggots crawling inside, of course. She didn't find anything other than a super fresh piece of meat. After the... Oh. Hey, come on. Have a stronger stomach, man. Man up. Anyway, some said it was the sign of the zombie apocalypse. Others said it might give you immortality. You know what? That might be true because uh, some of these weird meats throughout Chinese history have been said to give you some magical powers or, you know, radiation. Like, dude, are we done with that meat one? Yeah, we're done, but come on. Come Thanks, on, man. bro. You got a job to do. All Go right. ahead. Number seven, guys, abs of steel. Yeah. Okay, so moving on. I guess if I wasn't such a wuss, I could be more like this guy. A Chinese martial artist in Shandong demonstrates his iron stomach technique in front of many worried and uncomfortable onlookers by power drilling his belly. This video generated tens of millions of views on Tencent, a Chinese social media platform. Mike, you think this is an illusion? No, you know, I think it's actually real because in the past, there have been videos of Qigong masters in China uh, shown to withstand this type of punishment on their physical bodies. It's called the practicing hard Qigong. I mean, check this Shaolin monk out. He's taking a drill to his head. Even when I practice martial arts, like I wasn't like at the level of these guys, but I, my fingers were so strong, I could do like two finger push-ups. That's crazy, bro. You ready for some drilling, bro? Uh, that's called murder, though. And number eight, 80 person stage collapse. This shocking viral video is of an 80 person local police choir and gives new meaning to the phrase stage fright. During a rehearsal in Guizhou, the stage suddenly gave away and you can hear the immediate screams as the choir members reportedly dropped five meters or about 15 feet, followed by a loud crashing sound. <laughs> And finally, number nine, the Chinese floating city. This was super, super viral. Went viral everywhere, actually, all across the globe. But you know what? I don't buy it. I don't think it's real because uh, there's only one video and there's no other videos of this floating castle type mirage thing that everyone supposedly saw. I mean, look at it. Supposedly tens of thousands of people saw this, but there was only one video. Doesn't make any sense to me. But of course that didn't stop this video from not only being viral in China, but like you said, around the entire globe. Cause seriously, if something like that did show up, that would be a big deal. A lot of people actually speculated that it was some kind of NASA experiment yeah. that basically used holographic images to simulate the second coming of Jesus Christ. I mean, this is insane, right? It, it, it kind of reminded me of Independence Day where, where the oh. spaceships kind of appeared through the through the dark the clouds. clouds. But a lot of people actually speculated it could have been an alternate universe. No, it's somehow. Yeah, but I just don't understand why there's only one video. That didn't make any sense to me. I mean, Chinese people, we yeah. love videoing everything. Dude, I mean, how many people are in China? I mean, you would have thought at least there'd be a few hundred thousands more of people just like, you know what I mean? If I saw that, we'd all be like, oh my gosh, can you believe that? Yeah. All right, guys, well, that's our list. Not every single video is uber positive. I mean, doing viral videos doesn't mean like we pick the funnest ones and the most cutest ones, which, yeah. you know, they're, they're nice. But these we felt across the board represented the viral videos of 2015 in China. Of course, you know, I would like to see next year we can find some more positive, inspirational ones. Usually those are stories, not videos. But, you know, hey, if you guys know of some, send us some that were viral and, uh, you know, we might put it on for next year. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. See you. Bye.